Enjoy the open road or off-road a little bit more and let some of the outside in. This video will show you how to remove and reinstall your three-piece modular Freedom Top. To remove the Freedom Top, first, you'll have to remove both front panels starting with the driver's side. Start by opening both front doors and folding the sun visors down against the windshield. Now, turn the L-shaped locks from the front and rear center of the roof panel, then turn the L-shaped lock located on the outboard side of the panel above the shoulder belt anchorage. Unlatch the header panel latch located at the top of the windshield and remove the panel. Follow the same steps to remove the passenger side panel. You should store your Freedom Top panels in the storage bag that comes with your vehicle and secure the bag behind the rear seat or in a safe location. With the Freedom Top panels removed, you can now remove the rest of the Freedom Top. Open the swing gate all the way and lift the rear window glass. Using the provided number 50 Torx head driver and ratchet, remove the Torx head screw that secures the hard top at the B-pillar near the top of each front door. With the same tool, remove the six Torx head screws that secure the hard top to the vehicle, three on each side along the interior body side. You'll find the wiring harness on the left rear inside corner of the vehicle. To disconnect the harness from the hardtop, first release the locking tab by pushing it down. Then push the tab inward and pull down on the harness to disconnect. Remove the washer hose by pushing the release button on the hose connector and pulling downward. You can now remove the hardtop from the vehicle. It's recommended that you leave the rear window up and close the swing gate to the first detent. If left closed, the window may swing open while removing the top. Once you've removed the hardtop, place it on a soft surface to prevent damage. To reinstall the hardtop, follow the steps for removal, just in reverse order. Start by making sure the hardtop is properly positioned to ensure sealing. Verify that it's sitting flush with the body at the sides and check to ensure that there is a uniform gap between the lift glass and hardtop. Then follow these steps. Reattach the washer hose and wiring harness. Secure the hardtop to the vehicle along the interior body side with six Torx head screws, three on each side. Secure the hardtop at the B-pillar near the top of the front door with two Torx head screws, one on each side. To reinstall the front panels, start by setting the passenger side panel on the windshield frame, followed by the driver's side panel. Make sure the locating pins are in the front receiver mounting holes, that there is no overhang and that the panels are sitting flush with the body. On both sides, relatch the header panel latches, turn the L-shaped locks to the closed position, fold the sun visors back up, and you're all set. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.